Hi. So today I'm experimenting with uh, IGUS, IGUS filament, a sample. Uh, this is the first time I I try this uh, filament. Uh, this is going to be for my uh, anti backlash nuts for the detectors. Uh, it's quite difficult to print with this filament, but uh, I'm experimenting, so this is the first test. But uh, it seems to work okay, fine. So, uh, for the RK printer, this is the anti backlash nut. Uh, it has this screw and this little piece, little piece, uh, so I can adjust this screw to eliminate the play and anti backlash. Even though, uh, even without this screw and this part, there is almost no backlash. But it's nice to have an adjustable when you have play. Uh, now for the new one, I'm printing now. It's for the original design that I have changed it to this one. So the ori original design, it has, I'll show you on the computer. So this is the, this is the new design I'm making uh, with an X-Rail instead of the steel rods and the carbon fiber rods. So this will, a video for this is coming later showing the Uh, showing the working uh, printer with uh, the rail and talking about the design also so this the nut I was talking about Just to show you a quick view here So this is the original design it has this little part the same as uh, the one I showed you as also the upper part here so I can uh, so I can print these in a different material and this one in, in another pen like PETG or ABS or anything so these ones now are IGUS filament because it's very low friction also this one is working very nice but I still want to get rid of all the friction as uh, as possible Uh, this glass, uh, it was lying around, so I just I just used it. But now during this print, I just hear the crack. Then I, I came to see this. Yeah, uh, it's uh, it's not supposed to to heat to maybe 80 degrees. And also maybe these uh, clips are a bit off the bed. So they are putting a force out of the bed. But anyway, I have uh, another one and I have PEI sheet. The PEI sheet, uh, I just, I, I applied it then removed it because the uh, 3M or M3 uh, adhesive were very bad. There were a lot of bubbles big one and small ones so I wasn't happy about it it was completely bad so I just take it off I will will we'll see what uh, what I do again for this one anyway I will keep you updated about the, how this goes up how this goes but uh, I'm excited to test it I think it will be uh, very nice and I will use four lead screws instead of three. For now, it's very stable like this and very solid. But I, in this side, I just want to eliminate any uh, any playing. Even though there is no almost no playing, like maybe 0 0.1 or 0 0.2 when you apply a force on the sides. But I will just want to make it very stable. Uh, 
Okay, we'll keep you updated, updated guys. See you soon. Bye-bye.